Hey yo, welcome back to another Sons of the Forest how-to video. And on this video, I'm going to be showing you how to get that shovel. But hold on, before I show you how to get that fantastic shovel, I'm going to need to make sure you're subscribed real quick. I mean, just below the video, see that little subscribe button, hit that bad boy. Uh, actually, subscribing is going to be the only way to get the shovel. If you don't subscribe, you just can't get the shovel. Sorry. Anyway, now that that's out of the way, uh, let's talk about what you're going to need to get this shovel. So you're going to want to make sure that you have that rebreather, because you're not going to be getting the shovel without the rebreather. So uh, if you don't have that or don't know how to get it, go ahead and check out this video I made. I'll link it right up here. That's how to get the rebreather and the stun gun too. A little two for one combo for you. Now, as long as you make sure you got that rebreather, you're ready to go and get that shovel. So real quickly, I'll throw up a map. Right here is going to be where you're going to be getting that shovel. So I'll find that spot on the map and just start walking over there. And then once you get there, I'll show you how to get in. And then real quickly, I'll just show you on the GPS. This is what it's going to look like on a little handheld GPS. This is going to be that location for you. So once you get here, you'll see uh, three of your um, <clears throat> friends, old friends, um, just kind of, you know, chilling, hanging out, doing their thing. Uh, don't, don't mind them. Uh, just go ahead and work your way over to that cave entrance. And I'm going to walk up to the cave entrance, go ahead and uh, break that bad boy open, pull out my little flashlight. If you don't know how to get the flashlight, uh, I'll be having a video coming out soon on that. Maybe you're already out, depending on when you're watching this. So go ahead and just check out my channel and see if it's there. But now that in the cave, I'm going to eat some food real quick because I'm, I'm a little bit hungry. Should have should have eaten before, but oh well, here we are. Anyway, now that I'm nice and full, we're going to go ahead and continue our way down the cave. You'll see a zip line up here. Just go ahead, uh, grab on the back. And we go, wee! Don't worry, you won't take any fall damage. So, uh, yeah, you're safe. So this is why you're going to need the rebreather. You'll just immediately go into the water and then go down into this hole. Now, if you want to look around, I'm pretty sure there's loot around if you need that. If not, go ahead, hop down the hole and make your way through here. You'll start sliding down here. That's that's supposed to happen. Don't worry about that. Not gonna die. It may, it may spook you, but uh, you know, oh well. You land in water. You're safe. You know, Minecraft taught us that. And you'll look around, and then you'll go to the right over here. And there's gonna be a little uh, cave entrance to your left that you're gonna want to go through. And again, there's gonna be uh, you know, crates and all that and loot everywhere. So, go ahead and grab all that stuff. And then right here on this guy too is also going to be that uh, flashlight attachment for the pistol. Or I actually don't think you put it on the pistol yet. Uh, that's for the shotgun. Well, we'll, we'll get to that later, but uh, go ahead and grab that too. So, you know, since you're here. Alrighty, and we'll walk up here. We'll see this, you know, whack-ass structure in the cave. Um, you know, we'll, we'll get there later. Yeah, you can't walk over that way yet, but right in front of you is going to be that magnificent shovel that you're going to need to get a whole lot of the good stuff. Like that shotgun, you're going to need the shovel before you get the shotgun. So now that we have the shovel, we can go ahead and make our way out of this cave. Uh, there's really nothing else important in here. The you know, random loot like cloth and all that's going to be around here, but the shovel's what we came for and the shovel's what we're leaving with. And to get out, for the most part, we'll be going back the way we came. So just go ahead, hit a U-turn, and keep on moving.
So this is where getting out is going to be a little bit different. You'll see this guy kind of throw some rocks out of the wall. Uh, I might be able to shoot him. I don't know. I always just use a grenade. Go ahead, pull the pin, throw it at that bad boy. Blow him up, and this is going to be your exit. Uh, if you try to go the other way, you can't get out. So like, you got to go this way. But once you blow him up, it's just a straight path out. And just like that, we pop out of the cave, shovel in hand, ready to go and dig up everything we need. If you got confused at all throughout this video, just go ahead, drop a comment. I'll be looking at those the second they get posted. I'll respond back to you if you need any help. But it's pretty simple. There's really only one way to go in the cave, so, you know, hopefully you don't get lost. If you found this video useful in any way, go ahead and you know, drop a like for me. Help me out. Help push this video out to other people so maybe they can also find the shovel. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. See you in the next video.